Hey guys, this is Mac Tutorialification, and I'm here to show you Fisherdict 1, how to do your moving thing. If you don't know what it is, just watch the video, it's right here. You get the point. Um, so I'll show you. Um, so basically, what I did is I um, sort of did it simpler, more simply. I only did one image just to show you um, how to do it. But you could just repeat the process and get as many images as you as you want. This is my version, but it's better when you're going across because. See, like that, I go into the image and it doesn't look as cool. So it would be cool if I was here and I went across here. And then I'd leave an image trail. And um, here's how to do it. First of all, you need 50-point Bezier mat, I think. And um, the download's in the description. And then you just download it and extract it into your Final Cut um, effects folder. I'll show you how to do it in another video. Just ask if you want, or if you don't know how to do it. And, um, I'm just gonna restart everything. Um, where was my sequence? Okay, here. Yes. So, I get to a point where I want. Maybe start here. Okay. I press Shift N. And it goes to here, and then I just drag it down to here, drag it into the timeline, and then this is when you get you your ugh, this is when you get your fifty point bezier uh, mat. You drag it on, then you go to filters here. Oh, do you have to what? Okay. Yeah, okay, cool. Now, you use both of these screens. I suggest you zoom in to 100% here. And. Uh, here, ignore this blurry part, just fix on the main solid part, okay? Otherwise, it'll look crappy. Oh no, whoopsies. Uh. Okay, cool. Um, point one. Why is it so laggy? It's so laggy, I don't know why. Okay, point one. Come on. And I will put it... Here. Um, then point two. For some reason, this image looks really messed up. This is the longest part. I'm warning you guys. Um, the video, Fish Addict one, uh, the one which you sent me, it looks pretty professional. And professional videos take a lot of time. But it's worth it in the end. So, um, don't be lazy, guys. Otherwise, your video will turn out to be crap. And then you'll be blaming it on me. So, don't go blaming it on me. Okay, just go, going for my last few points. I only did 28 points, um, which isn't that much, I guess. So I need to get back lag. Okay, I need to get back to where that image was, or the place in it. Whoa. Nah. Okay. So... Is this the same? Yeah, this is the same. So, drag this up. 
drag it on the shorten it now um just render it for a second okay then just sometimes the first time you do it it's not always perfect let's see oh lag oh my god Yeah, you, you guys get the point, right? Just, um, what you need to do is, um, maybe, yeah, go, uh, I, I, I need, ugh, I need, as I said before, uh, you need to go being, you need to go across rather than just staying still because you could see him landing and it looks like I'm feeling him up, myself up, whatever. <laughs> and, um, by the way, that part in the video when the when the camera goes through that image, um, what they do is they get close up to it, and then once they're close up, they um, delete it so it looks like he's going through it. And if the camera's moving, which in that movie it was, I suggest you guys keyframe it. So when the camera's moving, the guy needs to be moving also, so it makes it look like it's going, um, like it's not moving, but it actually is. So, um, yeah, don't forget to download that, um, download, and, uh, don't worry, guys, I hate viruses, too, this is no scam, there's no survey, or anything, I hate those surveys, so, um, yeah, sub me, and hopefully I helped you fish your addict one, and have fun with your editing.